This place is like Camelot for an actor. Uh, and it has been since I was in high school. You know, the, to, the opportunity to work in a place that you visited over the years to see plays, and so I saw so many of my favorite actors for, in so many different things. And the way they do things here, the way they challenge themselves and the audiences in Shakespeare and classical theater in general, you know, there's just no place like it, certainly not in North America. Um, there's Stratford in England, but this place is probably even uh, bigger and stronger than that place. So I, you know, this is, in a sense, this is what, you know, you, you spend so much of your time in your career aiming towards something like this, doing rep, three completely different roles, Beckett, O'Neill, and Shakespeare. And after two or three weeks, uh, you know, you're saying to yourself, what have I done? But it's just to do those projects at this place, for me, is, you know, a very, very special thing to have happen to me. I think it had to do prob probably with Chris Plummer and I working together in, in Inherit the Wind on Broadway a year ago. And he was talking to Des about doing the Shaw, Caesar and Cleopatra, which he's going to do later this year. In fact, he'll be up here, I think, in a few weeks. Um, I don't think he's doing any other plays, except for <laughs> but that's Chris Plummer. He doesn't have to. Uh, but I think he and Des uh, first talked about the idea, and then they approached me, and I, of course, jumped. Because, like I say, this is, you know, this is a very, very special place if you're a serious American actor. If you're, as I have spent a lot of time in the theater, being aware of the theater, being aware of classical theater, um, as well as um, um, Chekhov and O'Neill and Miller. And uh, so when they mentioned it, uh, I hesitated for about two seconds. Then we figured out what we would do and how I would be involved, and here I am. Well, I, have, I don't know what I'm bringing to the role, but uh, it's, it's one of his later plays called a comedy, and there certainly are comic aspects to it. In fact, uh, Parolis and uh, La Fieu were played by some of these extraordinary veterans, Stratford Shakespearean actors are just, it's amazing to watch them and to listen to them and to learn from them, which, by which I mean stealing from them uh, as fast as I can fill up my pockets. <laughs> 